Hi there, it's Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell, the global leader in regenerative therapies. All right, today we're talking about stem cell therapy for inflammatory bowel syndrome, which is really an umbrella term for two conditions. One is Crohn's disease. The other one is ulcerative colitis. So I brought two friends with me today. One is Colin. The other one is Colleen, which are offtakes because they are colons. <laughs> and you can see what the problems are with Colin and Colleen is that they have all these lesions on themselves. And you know, they're very embarrassed about it. They're very shy. They don't like being on camera. So I'm just gonna put them down here for now. All right, guys. So the problem with Crohn's and ulcerative colitis is that up to half of the time, the traditional therapies with medications that we have fail, all right? And another issue is that a lot of these are immunosuppressive medications, which can unfortunately set you up for other disease issues because it you know, suppresses your immune system. Now, one of those is steroids. Steroids have a lot of potential side effects, especially if they're taken on a repetitive basis. Stem cell therapy for inflammatory bowel disease works amazingly well, and it doesn't have that problem. When you look at ulcerative colitis or Crohn's disease, you can get all kinds of problems in your colon. You can get strictures, fistulas. These can lead to a lot of chronic uh, abdominal pain. And there's a bunch of other, you can get kind of blood in your uh, stool and things like that. Uh, a lot of problems with your appetite. A lot of these patients lose a lot of weight. Stem cell therapy has been shown to work exceptionally well for all types of inflammatory bowel disease. And the treatment itself is given by way of an IV drip. There was a nice study at a Harvard University 20 years ago that showed that when you give stem cells IV, they float through the bloodstream and they will go to any area of your body that is experiencing inflammation. Well, it just so happens that inflammatory bowel disease has a lot of inflammation. It's an autoimmune disease where autoantibodies are working against you, okay? And stem cells will go to the areas of the bowel that are experiencing inflammation. They'll deposit themselves there and they will go to work. They will facilitate recovery of the bowel and they can help put you into remission. Studies show there was a nice one out of 2018 with over 80 patients with inflammatory bowel disease that two thirds of patients who had stem cell therapy went into remission for a period of up to three years. All right, we can't promise that, but it's a lot better than a lot of the traditional medications as far as their tolerance for you and their effectiveness, and then the side effects, right? So as I mentioned, you get an IV therapy, we do that uh, usually one to two million stem cells per kilogram, and that one treatment may be enough to help you out dramatically for up to three years. It can help decrease the amount of medications you need to take that the tr traditional medications with all the side effects. It can help reduce the side effects. Some of the side effects from steroids are irreversible. Avascular necrosis, adrenal gland issues, um, osteoporosis. There's a lot of different things that can be a complication. So at any rate, visit us online today at r3stemcell.com. Behind me, you can see the consumer guide with stem cell therapy for inflammatory bowel disease that I wrote. It summarizes all of the global research studies that are peer reviewed and very good. Okay, they'll show you the outcomes and we'll set you up with a free consultation. We have over 40 centers in seven countries that can provide you the treatment. And just call us at 844-GET-STEM with the plus one for the USA prefix. We'll set you up with that free consultation. All right. Thank you. Colin and Colleen say thank you as well.